Dude, yeah, the, re- the parenting thing isn't even close to what I'm say- saying. No, no, you're on a different but, level. But um, but like because like li- most of life, like we have 24 hours, and uh, what I'm saying is, as a parent, dude, one time, all right, man, like this is a good example. Oh damn, is this water good? Oh, it looks fucking neon. But like what somebody, dude, I'm I'm not gonna bring up a name or nothing. But I was texting somebody like an idea. Yeah, you know. And um, you'll know who said this, you know, and I was just like texting an idea. And then the guy was like, oh, you procrastinate more than like you do, you know. But like what he doesn't know is like I was sitting there with Riley and Rowan. Like, yeah, I couldn't do anything. You can't anyways. do anything. And anyhow. I do all the time. Like I'm always on my laptop. Yeah. And sometimes like I got to hang out with my daughter. Yeah. So like as I'm texting, it's not, dude. And like most of my ideas, I get around to. You do. Sometimes I kind of get like <laughs> so defensive bad, about it. Yeah. Because like, dude, I do. Dude, when it comes to what the fuck and shit, it's like, you know, I feel like there's a pressure for us to make it. But really, I just want people to appreciate our journey. What we're doing. And yeah. trying to make yeah, it. Yeah, for sure, dude. Like the money and all that. It, we're almost just trying to just, you know what I'm saying? It ain't about money, dude. No, and it when isn't. we sell merch, it's like because we're trying to grow what we're trying to do. 100%. And like a lot of the time, like, you know, people support us. And I understand like money and stuff. But like, like buying a t-shirt just improves like we don't buy like our own stuff with it like we're investing it into what the fuck but it's why. going right back yeah just it. i'm just 100%. saying so people know yeah right you know? and it's dope shit mm-hmm. you know and the whole mission of what the fuck but why and yeah. where it's become you know yeah. it's it's turned into from some fucking change the world shit yeah bro. it's straight up change the world shit and that was the first fucking Thing that I said, dude, you want to go talk about this? Yeah. When we first fucking started, what the fuck, but why? You you were trying to get me to get on fucking Rogan. You're like, dude, you got to listen to Rogan. You got to listen to Rogan. I'm like, finally, I broke down. I fucking listened to Rogan. Mm-hmm. And it was, I remember it was uh, the Smashing Pumpkins, dude. I forget his name. Billy Corgan? Billy Corgan. It was that episode. And yeah. they were talking about musicians from Florida. And they're like, oh, what's a musician from Florida? And they were naming musicians from Florida. Mm -hmm. And I was sitting there like, Tom Petty, Tom fucking Petty. And then no one even said fucking Tom Petty. And that just fueled me, dude. It like, God, I was like so emotionally involved with wanting to say something on that fucking podcast. Yeah. And it was like, all right, fuck this, dude. Me and Jason Fryer can do this shit. So I remember coming down the ladder and calling you and being like, and just telling you like, dude, this shit just seems easy. Like, Mm -hmm. it doesn't seem like anything that we couldn't do. We could do this. And you're like, yeah, we could. I'm like, bro, we could change the fuck fucking world yeah you did and you're like yes we could yeah. and that was like where what the fuck but why the spirit yeah was like born yeah you know what i mean yeah. and i fucking forgot about that for a while because yeah. i got all caught up in my own shit yeah you know what i mean but that's that that first spark hasn't changed right so you're right dude it's way more than the money that we're yeah, fucking trying to get on to yeah dude. and the money would just be freedom it would yeah to be with our kids and our family right right and the freedom to create what we want to create to have an impact on the fucking environment that we live in we want to have a, an impact and i was thinking even because sometimes i get carried away with my imagination on how big it could get yeah you know what i mean and i don't give a fuck how big it gets i want it to be important so then why do you I want worry it to be important. about that so much what like how big it is. How big it is. We were talking about this earlier because of cancel culture and shit like yeah. that. You know, like it's fucking scary to like actually put your fucking face out there. I know. It's scary, dude. Dude. I mean, like and a lot of us, what, what was I saying earlier about fucking cancel culture being the virus of the creative minds? Because there's so many people oh. out there that, are, that have done fucked up shit. They've mm. lived life. It's not even doing fucked up shit, bro. Yeah. It's just living life. Like fucked up shit happens when you're living life yeah you know what i mean and sometimes you make poor choices and sometimes things just happen yeah you know what i'm saying but this fear of cancel culture there's so many people out there i know that are just screaming I know. screaming inside to get their fucking voices out there I know. but they're held back by this cancel culture bullshit dude so it's like disease in creativity it's like a disease of creativity man there's so many people out there right yeah and i'm yeah. one of them dude like i'm fucking scared to put my shit out there i think i think we're pretty equal like i don't know man i, I guess like i'm scared too you know yeah just being honest yeah just because i have a job yeah I but that's that. I, that's why I sometimes yeah i think i'm like i think this is like two let's keep going right uh but anyways, oh, I probably should have left it, so 
even where it was, where it was before. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, watch yeah, now like, it's different now, it? yeah. But um, if I didn't have a job, I wouldn't care at all. You'd go full board. Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Dude. Oh I feel you on that. And That's I why, like, I'm I'm realizing more and more that I'm so blessed with the job that I have. Yeah. You know, having my own company and being able to... That's why, I'm like, my life right now is so perfect for doing this shit. Yeah. And I'm finally seeing it. Yeah. Like, it's all fucking coming together. Like, since we started What the Fuck But Why, it was always, like, just kind of a dream. Yeah. And, you know, like, oh, well, it's just something we do. And then, you know, I fucking... Went through my midlife crisis and all that shit, but I learned so much, and I'm learning. I'm still learning so much, but like, I completely lost my train of thought, bro. What <laughs> like was that saying, bro? There's something good coming out of me. I have to like, know where you're going with it, though, because we can. You can go any way. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, right, right. <laughs> like the way my life is yeah, designed right yeah. now. Yeah, the way like how I can. Like owning my own business and being able to do just like one or two jobs per week and still be able to support my family. Like, that's the biggest blessing ever. And I don't even know how it fucking happened. I think, like, I could say your biggest, the, I would say, like, the worst case scenario that could happen for you, but like I think to get to that point is almost unrealistic to me. That's what get stops to what me. what point? Where the cancel culture would really like affect you. What do you even really? Oh, okay. Yeah, like I don't know, dude. I just think like I don't know what to think of it actually. Like, you know, dude? yeah, like, yeah. Like sometimes I'm like, dude, I just want to be like a little cool underground that, thing. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, like, yeah, dude. Like I was gonna put a disclaimer. Like they were saying, dude, I'm glad you just brought that up because Ethan from H3. This is a reaction. All right, I'm, like he tweeted. That he after look let's go right to it. Hold on. Uh, you gonna do a reaction? Yeah, this was well, actually a tweet, but I want to talk about it. Uh, wow, you're looking at me. Look down. You see that right behind my laptop down here? Subscribe, support. Seriously, you know we work our asses off to supply content to you. So pay it forward, pay it back, like our channel. God damn it! Shout out Styles.